Greetings folks and welcome to yet another tutorial on my channel. Today's video will be a bit different from the previous ones. I am going to make a remix instead of a remake cause remakes ain't fun. And to make this even more entertaining I decided to remix what a normal person would never remix, a Disney soundtrack. To choose a song for this purpose I had to watch all Disney movies, which actually took me 3 months, trust me, I am not lazy, I've been just working a lot. After tiring months of hard work I've stopped on one of the greatest songs of all time, Into the Unknown from Frozen 2, performed by Adina Menzel and Aurora. Into the this song is extremely beautiful, the orchestration and Adina's powerful voice stuns me every time I listen to it. That's why I am going to put my hands on it and turn it into an EDM song. Turning an orchestral song into electronic genres is as easy as finding a girl who loves me. Extremely challenging. Orchestral arrangements tend to have a much more complex structure which is to be simplified in order to fit into any EDM style. If you are not a nerd and don't want to hear the nerdy musical staff, skip to this timecode to just listen to the remix. I began by making an intro. I took a kick. Two percussion loops. Added the main chord from the original song's intro. And on top of that goes an arpeggio. Between two halves of the intro I put a short part of a riser which seemed quite creative to me, and I like creativity. The intro turned out like this. After that goes a bridge. I wanted to go pretty minimalistic but aggressive with this. I just made a super powerful bass and put some notes, which don't actually follow the original chords pattern because it would be boring. For the second part of the bridge I returned the percussion and added an arpeggio. Now to the build up. For this part I used a similar bass which follows the root notes of the drops chords. I also introduced a part of the main melody with one of the main leads. Now slap on a long fill, a riser, and some white noise and the build up is done. Before we move on, I would kindly ask you to leave a like on this video and subscribe to my channel, it will make me a billion times happier, hoo woo. And now the most interesting part, the drop. I began by making the bass. I decided to go with an aggressive rolling bass to add dynamics to the drop so that you couldn't help dancing when you hear it. The bass sounds like this. Then goes a simple wide pad to add harmonics.
The melody is actually from the original song where it is played by short strings. All I did was change the sound to an electronic lead. Drum part is just a generic beat with some additional kicks to make you dance even harder. Throughout the whole drop an additional lead plays a rising melody to create tension to the end of the drop. Apart from different effects that's everything about it. Everything which is after the first drop is just the same thing over and over again. Just, just like, like my life. life. Anyways, let's listen to the final result. Thank you for watching this video. See you in the next one sweetheart.